Hi, hello, and welcome to the Legacy Lost Radio and Music Paradise. This is just a quick uh, overview of another uh, radio I got. Uh, this is a uh, ICOM IC207H. It is a dual band uh, mobile radio. Um, probably oh, around, uh, I'd say, 15, 20 years old or so. It doesn't have alpha tags. It's a. Uh, Interesting radio. It has a VHF final and a UHF final. The uh, VHF final does not work on this, and I heard there was issues with the uh, the heat sink uh, compound when they put it together on from the factory. They didn't apply enough heat sink compound or something, and apparently that was an issue with the uh, VHF finals on these. But uh, other than that, uh, it's got tone squelch. Um, it's got. Uh, I can tell you it's got at least 100 channels just off uh, what I remember. Um, I programmed a bunch of them in. Um, I got this off a friend. Actually, got two of them. I gave one to another guy. And uh, it came with this uh, ICOM mic. It's a... Um, I don't see the model number right here. Or did I walk right by? But this is a... Uh, I don't believe this is the factory microphone. But anyway... Um, it stays lit all the time. I don't know if you can see that or not. But anyway, um, it's an interesting radio. Um, got a fan in there. It's got a... You know, what else we got in here? A squelch. Um, three power levels. I think it's 50, 10, and 5, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, it's got a lot of... Uh, we call it? It's got good audio. Um, got good transmit uh, reports on the UHF side. Let's see if I can... Uh, Get some of these, uh, again, there's no alpha tags. That's the K4GCC repeater locking up. Let me see if I got some of the weather things in here. I added about uh, 20 different things. Here we go. I noticed that the day, uh, Daytona NOAA station's been acting kind of funny. Did you see that just before? It's been doing that on and off for... That's Orlando's. That's uh, Melbourne, Brevard County. Again, that's our county here. And uh, pretty simple radio. You just hit the button, go up and down the scan. Um, does uh, AM uh, airband. Um, I think this radio may have been a Mars mod at some point in time. There's uh, The guy I got this from said he got a pair of them at the... Uh, one of the ham fests in Orlando, I believe it was. So, anyway, that's just a quick uh, overview of the ICOM 207H. And what I'm going to do with this is use this as pretty much a standalone UHF radio for uh, SARNET. If I ever uh, need be, you have to travel or anything, uh, this will be a SARNET uh, purposed radio on UHF. Though, uh, maybe I'll get this fixed sometime if it's even worth bothering with the final on the VHF. So, 73. And uh, please uh, subscribe and give us a thumbs up. Take it easy.